I'm really running out of things to say because I don't have a lot which I really want to do. I mean, this is a this goalkeeper, this replacement goalkeeper is the only thing I'm really working on at the moment. So yeah, we'll just let this go. Um, in Zoni, I'll just really quickly mention he's gone for 20 million. I don't know what level he's at now, but that guy grows like tons. I was considering buying him at the start of the season, or but uh, yeah, of course I didn't grab that. Uh, simming, simming, simming. Hoping, hoping now to get a, a response back from CSK, a Moscow or whatever his name is. Okay. Borussia Dortmund, retransfer offer. Who did, before I open it, who did they put an offer on before? Hmm. I can't actually remember. Uh, Kabaya. Okay, for 23, so that's 3 million more. Still no, the only way I'm going to sell him is if it's like 30 million again. Because if there's, uh, if I'll, I'll be, t I'm, no, I'm normally completely happy to sell uh, a really, one of my better players if I get a lot of money for him. Okay, good, they've accepted the offer. I think I need to go back and actually, yeah, I need to go back and... Uh, readjust my cash for wages. So, um, just give me a minute. I'll just, um, budget allocation. 21. Uh, yep, sure. Cool. That's enough. Good. I have enough. I'm pretty much going to sell the majority of my money trying to get this guy. But, um, yeah, I'll just do the same thing. What I normally do is make that 75 and 20%. Again, I still have not found out what actually happens if you give them a percentage because I just. I just, I don't see what happens. Anyway, Simming against Bolton in the FA Cup. I think um, they said, oh, at the start of the season, they said that they wanted me to get... Yes, good. The, the board doesn't really care all too much about whether or not you can at, um, you complete like the, the cup objective. It's really a matter of where you finish on the ladder, which normally says whether or not you had a good season, a great season, or a poor season. So, uh, yeah, anyway, tournament prize money, 108 grand. Yeah, we can make some... Whatever. Anyway, this game again, it's against the uh, away. Well, I'm playing a lot of games considerably. I, at the start of January, they'd said we only had to play about three or four games. And, yeah, okay. So they're backed out for Kabaya. Okay, I'm keeping him, which is good. And uh, But it, it's going to be a lot more interesting when we get to uh, the transfer deadline day because that's when some really big... Oh, good. We've got Igor. I'm just going to call him Igor from now on because I can fev. Whatever. <laughs> Moving on. We got him. Good stuff. Okay. Great goalkeeper, 85. I think he's the best overall, the highest overall on the team. Yes, he is. So, bang, bang. I can have... I'll just keep this again. Nice and neat. Like a move immediately. Bo, oh, what are you doing? Okay. i got to sell Bar now. What am I doing? I didn't mean that. Okay. So now I've got to sell Denver Bar. That was not something I wanted to do anyway. I would definitely use the money. What the fuck? Are you kidding me? <laughs> what? This is making it so tempting. How do, can you? How can you be all of a sudden 50 million more than what you were when you're the exact same stat? Well, pretty much the exact same stats. Oh well. Uh, FA Cup, Wigan. Again, I'm just simming everything. I really, I, I would really like to get to the FA Cup final if possible. But yeah, it's still possible with the J Bucks goal in the eighth minute. My virtual pro kicking ass. But anyway, moving on. Uh, okay, advance. So, let's see. We've got a Liverpool offer, surely for Bar. Yeah, what the fuck? Nuts! That is insane. That is sick. He's only worth, what, 28 something? Yeah, sick. That is really good. You know, actually, what, one thing that I actually do sometimes do, and I'll do it here, I know this may technically be um, considered cheating, I guess, but I'm gonna stall both of these. And uh, if it doesn't work, then maybe obviously that's a little bit of a, obviously that's quite, obviously, well, that's just kind of, kind of like, uh, well, you deserve it. But what I'm going to do now, I'm going to say, because I've got two offers for a player which are excessively more than what they're worth, I think if they were going to bid that much, surely they'd bid a little bit more. So that's saved. I'm going to go back to transfer negotiations, and I'm going to say no to both of them, surely because... Surely one of them will hit me again. At least one of them will hit me again. Hopefully it's Liverpool with a re-offer of possibly... We could get 40 million for Bar, possibly. But, um, yeah. I think that's amazing considering I put him on the transfer market and they've offered like 6 or 8 million more than what his actual stuff is. Liverpool say no, but Arsenal say yes. Denver Bar situation sold him. They said no. How much do they want from 26 and a half? Which is technically the amount that Liverpool were given to him. But now I'm giving them to... Now I'm giving Bar to Arsenal instead of Liverpool. So, yeah, it doesn't matter. You can't complain with 36 million. Thank you very much. I'll surely be able to pick up some talent for that. Maybe even a young gun that's going to hopefully grow relatively quickly. I mean, um, there's a lot of them in this game. It's just really a matter of if they do it or not because, 
you know, sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. But anyway, 36, I, how much money have I got now? Uh, buy players, striker, want to get a good one, 80, 35 and a half an hour. That's, that's relatively good. I might, 85, I think I actually want um, someone with relatively good uh, ball control. Ball control. Let's go for 90 for ball control, just to see. Obviously, I'm not expecting a lot of names. Hopefully, we should get some pretty good ones, but we'll just see who we have. For ball control, 90. Obviously, Messi is going to top the list here. Come on. Yes. All right. Jonas. All right. Antonio Cassano. Neymar. Oh, can't afford him. Can't afford him. Can't afford him. Can't afford him. Okay. We'll try it again. Let's take it down to 85. Seven it again. For 35 million, um, normally, you put on these offers, you're going to need to do... I think I've said this before, but I always try to put on... I always take what the player's estimated worth is. Like, for example... Well, I don't know, let's say Sergio Aguero, and I try to take what the, I try to take one fifth of what his estimated worth is, which in his case is 12 million, uh, 12 million, and then pretty much just add 12 million, so I might offer 72 million for him, or 72 million and a half, if I want to be safe, but really, okay, it doesn't, it doesn't really matter, that's just my little way of doing things, but okay, we've got a lot more names now, I'll take it to the bottom, I might sort them on a basis of age as well, so, do that one more time. Can't afford him, can't afford him. No, 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 definitely no, no, no. Giovinco, ah, uh, no, can't afford him, unfortunately. But look at him. Jeez, Giovinco would do pretty well. Suarez, can't, no. Jekko, no, no, no. Tet, no, no. Jonas, I can, but he's like 80, so pff, probably not. Yeah, I might actually be able to afford Sturridge here. I would actually think Sturridge isn't that bad to buy. I think what I might do, uh, yeah, no, fuck it. I'm, I'm going to put money on for storage. So this deal looks like it, ha it could happen as well. So again, let's do the math, everybody. What's one fifth of 27? I don't have no fucking idea. Okay. <laughs> I'll put in the offer for storage and uh, yeah, hoping on storage. Wow, they got a lot of people. They got a lot of people out. I'll be very surprised if I don't win this. Uh, come on. Oh, that is such bullshit. How? Okay. Petrovic, Vucevic, fucking, oh, I hate the Vicks so much, fucking Vicks, don't mean that, oh, no offense to you Victorians, okay, um, J-Box, you got the goal in the 86 minute, but obviously that's not good enough, oh, how do you lose that, that's unbelievable, you're third on the freaking ladder for Christ's sake, how can you, yeah, I don't know, oh well, too bad, where are we now, player returns from injury, Gavin Harris, we can sell him, yes, and the unacceptable 39 million for storage, get the fuck out of here. Alright, I'm giving up for storage, no good. But, before I buy any of my phenomenal players, I'm putting Gavin Harris on the... What the fuck? What the fucking fuck? If you don't know what I'm talking about, what do you mean he's not injured anymore? You just told me. What the... Seriously, what the fucking fuck? He's 21 years of age, he just went up in an overall, and he's worth 76 million now. What the fuck are you doing? What the hell is this bullshit? This is black magic. EA, what the... Okay, no. Just, just no. I'm not gonna let it get to me. This is this is fucked. This is so so fucked. Okay, I think I have to let this sim ahead for a little bit before I can actually list him because apparently he might still be injured today, but not tomorrow. What the what the hell? <laughs> I don't know. I might I might be able to sell hopefully Gavin Harris and get a little bit more for him. I'm not gonna sell Santiago Munoz. Remember what I said about uh, Santi that I would only sell him. I would only sell him if um yeah okay whatever mate. I would only sell him if I'm not putting him on the list. I'm not putting him on the transfer market. But if I get an offer from Real Madrid, what are you talking about? He said Santiago. You said Gavin Harris was good to come back. Hang on a minute. Let me just sort this out. If if it doesn't let me put on the freaking, he says he's fine. He's got a broken tailbone. Who gives a shit? Okay. I'll put him. I'll put him. There. I don't know if that's going to help me out anyway. I might. I don't want to give him a game or anything, but. Uh, <laughs> Why are you letting me put him on the freaking transfer? I don't know. Okay. Uh, next match. I'm just going to keep simming it. What I'll do is right on the transfer deadline, that's when I'm going to actually try to buy a new striker and then put Gavin Harris on the transfer window. Hopefully, he'll not have that band-aid anymore. I don't think... I actually don't think Vermaelen... Yeah, it's a draw. Not great. Um, I don't think Vermaelen actually has his band-aid thingy on there anymore. I hope not, at least. So... No, he doesn't, so he's been able to get over it. Hopefully, Gavin Harris should be able to get over it before 
the uh, end of the month, hopefully. So anyway, we'll just keep simming it and wait until we get, and we're not far off either. So, no. Oh, this, this will be interesting. Hopefully I'll be able to put him, hopefully I'll be able to sell him. Uh, but anyway, it really all comes down to this, the transfer deadline date. I'll just give, I'll just wait for the kick-ass cinematic to come through. Transfer deadline day. That's what I'm fucking talking about. Let's do it. Okay. Can we sell him? I'd be really disappointed if we can't. You are fucking full of shit. That's bull. Okay. Can I put... Uh. Oh, well, i got to buy a player. Of, I have to buy a striker with the money that I've got. That is a little bit annoying. Uh, okay. What am I doing? Sell players. Okay. Buy players. What I'm going to look for now is a striker 80 of no particular... You know, nothing in particular, just go overall, 80, yeah, bang. I'll just reset it, actually. Let's make it 75, I really don't care. I mean, I've got J-Bucks, I mean, this guy's really just, just in case I don't actually have a good, like, that just in case I need him. So, 75, uh, striker, 23 years of age or lower, hopefully get someone really, maybe not cheap, but someone that can grow tons. I mean, we'll just see what presents itself to me. Again, I'll say...